Hi, my name is Gavin McGrath. I work in the Development and Innovation Unit in BIM. This short tutorial is on the subject of completing your project plan. This is part of BIM's series of mini tutorials to guide applicants through the Processing Capital Support Scheme, which BIM is administrating on behalf of the Department of Agriculture, Food and the Marine and is funded by the Brexit Adjustment Reserve. Completing your project plan. Your project plan is part of section three of your application, organizational governance and capacity. In total, section three is worth 20 marks from the total available, 100 marks for your application. You can submit your project plan in section 3.2. You're required to provide at least one measurable milestone that will be delivered by the end of each quarter across the term of your project. There are no maximum number of phases that should be included. The larger the project is in scope, complexity, or cost, the more milestones the project should be broken into. The minimum milestones that should be addressed are procurement, delivery and installation, final payment, and grant reporting. Please give each milestone a name in the milestone box. In this example, we will use procurement completed and contractor appointed. How you will show it has been completed in the form of evidence box, for example, a signed contract. And select the time frame that the milestone will be completed in the quarter completion box, commencing with quarter three, 2022, and ending with quarter four of 2023. Milestones outside these dates will not be accepted and will result in the application being rejected. You are required to add a milestone for each quarter until your project completes. To do this, press the add another row on the right hand side. If you added a row accidentally, select remove row on the right hand side. Grantees will be required to report quarterly on progress of the grant. This will be compared to the milestones and timelines provided under this criteria to determine whether the project is on track or off track and whether it remains feasible to deliver the project and process payment prior to the scheme closure date of the 31st of December, 2023.